Hey everyone, I'm not a rock star, and this is Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga. So, last time, we came in here to the Yoshi Theater and got the third piece of the Bean Star by giving the owner uh, seven neon eggs, which weren't even really neon, but whatever. Um, and this time, we're going to go. Where exactly is it? It's in between the Bean Bean Airport and the Woohoo University to retrieve the fourth and final piece of the Bean Star. So last episode when running around collecting the bean fruits, I opened up what I assume is the pathway down there. So I'm just gonna head right back to where that was, because it's pretty close when you're successfully dodging all the enemies like a pro. I, as I say that, that pair of beanie almost gets me. So we gotta go up there, and over here, and then, no, it wasn't down here. Wait, it was over here, actually, wasn't it? No, never mind, I'm dumb, it is this way. Okay, no, the, oh, the tree blocked me, but then I got up and then I fell down because I assumed I didn't make it. Okay, yeah, it's right here, so we can go down here now. Um, last episode, these things had chuckle beans under them, so I guess I'll start grabbing those. Um, wait, there's this way. I guess I'll grab that chuckle bean before I forget about it. But I want to go this way. Um, okay, there is more bean. Uh, possibly more bean once again, yep. And then, a bunch of money to grab. Let's go. Ooh, and a Hoobean. I feel like I might have enough <laughs> Hoobeans to make something at this point. Definitely not a Hoo blend, but some kind of combination drink. Um, and a safe book. And let's keep going. Uh, right down this path. Splurt assistant, inquire within. Dot dot dot. Ask for Har Hall. I don't understand any of what was just said, and oh hey, there's the bean star, let's just like, smash this open with a hammer or something. Why can't we just do that? Yarf! Impossible! No way am I working with co explosive colors like those. Burp. Water. Drank. Too much water. Okay, are these all, like, the re rejects <laughs> leaving the studio? Honestly, what is one to do with such riffraff? Hello. Oh, welcome, welcome! I am called Harhol, genius designer, and I am also called Bleach. Yes, we are one and the same. What? Did you know? No. Did you know? Yes. Uh, yeah, totally. Yes, yes, whatever. Am I correct in assuming you're interested in the Splart Assistant opening? Fine, fine. If you do a decent enough job, I'll pay you. Your pay will be... A bean-like thing that cascaded down from the heavens. Ta-da! I mean, that wouldn't be considered great pay any other situation except this time. So, I mean, I'll take it. What? Do you have some sort of complaint? Hmm? 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 That's better. Now then. Uh, what did... <laughs> did this person just scare the pipes into working? You can help me with my splurt right away. But you must be snappy. Just do it and get it done. Now, don't mind me. I'll just give you a little advice while you work. Trust me, you'll need it. First, go have yourself a drink so you can become a proper splurt water pump. Once you're able to pump out water like a human fire hydrant. Step on these little footmarks. Try it. Okay, we've done this many times before. Mario, inhale all the water. And out comes a flying bob bomb. Fine, fine. I'll explain the method to my genius. Though the genius of splurt defies explanation. 
Didn't- is- isn't the black part there when it just faded out, isn't that like a void? Uh, like, how- how did you walk over there? Well, whatever, I guess. First, you must dye the fabric. Press the B button to shoot water at the design bomb. Try it already, try it! Okay, smack- <laughs> oh, he was so spooked. The color of the design bomb you hit. It's the same as the shirt, who would have guessed? Colors, the fabric. Oh, by the way, if you hit two design bombs at the same time, then the fabric color becomes a mixture of those two colors. Don't forget, it's vital to splurt. Oh, and one more teensy thing. If you're dying fabric and you think, barf, that's all wrong. Just talk to Bleach. He'll make the fabric nice and shiny white for you. I thought you were Bleach. Isn't that what you said? <laughs> Well, whatever. Once you're done dying, then you choose your design. So you get to shoot water at the artsy bombs again. Isn't it just so fun you could die? Haha, <laughs> I get the joke. So we hit this plaid pattern, and bam. The design of the design bomb you shot. Alters the design on your duds. Also, I just realized, why is this shirt so massive? The design bomb patterns are... The tropical design, or just stripes. The polka dot design, and oh, and the checkered design. By the way, if you hit two or more design bombs, the pattern always ends up being a star. Remember that. Once you're done with the design, I'll decide if it perfectly matches the artistic vision of Splurt. So yeah. Anyway, that's the method to my genius. And now I'll need you to. to I'll need you to finish four outfits for me, okay, boys? Hop to it! That's all I have to tell you, so get started on your first assignment with all speed. As for design, anything will do. Just give me a red color. Okay then. Um. Bump. And we get red shirt. And hello. This has no pattern. Oh. I have to also do a pattern. Okay. So, let's do this. I don't care, let's go with that. <laughs> All three. Yes, that's it, that will do. Next, on to the next one. Let's see, the next design is... I want something in yellow. Oh, and in a checkered pattern. Okay, we have our design in mind. Hit it right about then. It's nice that the ball bombs stop moving. Whenever you press the B buttons, so you don't have to worry about- Oh no, shoot. But, as I was saying, you don't have to worry about timing it for when they move. Yeah, I know. I know what you wanted, I just messed up because I'm bad. Okay. Waiting again for the yellow, right then. And then the checkered design right then. And bam! Yes, that's it. That will be fine. Next on to the next one. Yep, next design is purple with polka dot flare. Okay, I know colors, and purple is red and blue. So, bam, purple, and then we gotta get more water to do the polka dot design. Okay, uh, no, the checkered one bounced back faster than I thought it would. Okay, that's unfortunate this time for sure, though. And right then, okay. Now I might have to wait a bit longer for everything to become a bit more desync. There we go. Purple with polka dots. Uh, the next design is... I'm, I'm depressed. I crave brown, but with a star. Remember to make a star pattern? Yep. Okay, so we gotta get all three colors, I guess. How are we going to do that? No... Oh, no, I just barely missed the yellow. Well, it doesn't really matter what I do, so. Okay, what if I just spam B, because they all come out at around the same time. Okay, yeah. And then just spam B again, because that's how I got the star pattern there. And then just spam B. <laughs> well, that's a good strategy. Splendid, we're all done here. This means I must pay you with a bean-like- with a bean-like thing, as promised. 
Go next door and get your pay. Okay. Let's do as they said. Move on over here. Hello. See, here is the bean-like thing I promised you. Take it with you. Opens the lock, and the bottom falls out. That's interesting. But we got the last piece of the bean star. We got a piece of the bean star. Now you have all four pieces. Hur hurry, back to Bean Bean Castle. I was about to say hooray. And I mean, that also kind of works, but that's not what it said, so. Hey, do you have any more work for me? Oh. I really just opened it. Okay. Ah, nice work. You guys are incredible. If I need help again, I'll be coming to you. So you don't need more help. Okay. Well then, I guess we will go right over to B&B Castle. That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to jump. Okay, here in B&B Castle, let's head back up to the throne room. We got all four pieces for a five-pointed shape. The Bean Star is revived. You got the Bean Star. We did. Hmm, so the Bean Star is finally back to normal. A message has arrived from Bowletta. I shudder to think. Oh, the Game Boy Advance is orange this time. Very good. You fools make fine scavengers. Now, I want red and green to bring that Bean Star to me. The drop point is at the far end of the ocean, at that crypt for cruddy jokes called Joke's End. You can't get to Joke's End by walking on the sea floor, so don't try it, Cretans. Come after you learn how to cross the sea surface. And don't lose the Beanstar in the way, Butterfingers. Hmm, but if he... she... uh... it... plans to return Princess Peach when we give it the Beanstar then it can't be planning to use Peach's voice to awaken the Bean Star after all. That would seem to be so. No, no, no. Relax, all of you. We can just give the fiend this. Oh, a fake Bean Star, of course. You got a fake Bean Star. Also, please take along a change of clothes for the princess. I'm sure that Princess Peach likely tried to escape, doing untold damage to her lovely dress. Just thinking of it drives me mad. Curse that Bowletta. At least this old servant can help in some small way. And we got Peach's extra dress. We're getting all kinds of fun things right now. To get the joke's end, you have no choice but to travel above the ocean waves. Perhaps if you go to the beach, you'll find a way to get there. Apparently, there once was quite a fine surfing spot at one of this land's beaches. Yeah, I can think of a cool surfing spot I saw once, but we need the Ultra Hammers for that, so I assume we need to get those. Excellent. Then the two of you will execute our daring plan. Oh, I almost forgot. You won our little Beanstar wager, so here are your mushroom coins. Uh, all of those. Also, didn't he say it was Bean Bean coins before? Well, whatever. At today's exchange rate, that amount comes to 99 Bean Bean Coins. <laughs> so, inflation, either Tollstar was terribly wrong, or Mushroom Kingdom has been totally pumping out coins for some reason. Because there's no way the price would get that inflated that fast. Um, also, things I just remembered. I said I would check out the Piranha Swing. Uh, recovers HP with solo hammer attacks. I'm good. Don't use solo hammer attacks that often. Piranha swing bad. But speaking of hammer swings, it is time to investigate the possibility of getting ultra hammers. So if I remember, we go this way. No, it's the other side. Right? You exit out of the right side of Bean Bean Castle Town. Because it's on the way to Teehee Valley, so it would be over here. So we go over here, then up a screen, Lackapy, stop it. And then we go over here. M making sure... Uh, making sure to employ evasive maneuvers, like the pro I am. 
take this shortcut that I didn't take last time. And hello, um, hammerhead bros, can you make me a better hammer? Whoa, I was wondering who that might be, and it turns out to be those Mario bros again. You guys have the best timing. Why, we just now finished mastering a brand spanking new hammer making technique. Want us to re-reforge your hammers for you? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Why not? In that case, this will be the debut of our new hammer making technique. We'll get right to re-reforging. Here we go. On your toes. Oh. <laughs> okay. That is interesting. Ooh, that's some fine work we did. These are definitely the finest hammers available. They're even more powerful than before. And we got Ultra Hammers. Okay. With those hammers, you can break any kind of rock. Any kind at all. You, we've used all our talents in making these hammers. May they serve you well. And, I also remember, we can break this black rock back here. Oh, and this one right here. Ooh, hello again, Thwomp. I am Thwomp, and I love a good game. Test your luck for a mere 500 coins. Are you guys ready to show me the mightiest swing you've got? Uh, yes. Let's get whatever this item is, which is probably a bros attack for Luigi. Break any one of these that you like with your hammer. If you're lucky, you'll get yourself one incredible treasure. Okay, I'm gonna have Luigi break it for good luck, and we can try this three more times. So I hope it works out. Let's go. Ooh, okay, we got money, not quite the reward. Oh, 800 coins, wow. Net gain, let's go. Okay, what about this time? Uh, I'm gonna try the middle rock, because that was the one that worked for me last time. Nope, okay, just got scammed. That's why you never gamble, though. Let's see how long it takes me to get this. Ooh, there we go. It took, like, <laughs> ten tries or so, but we got Secret Scroll 2. So now Luigi has a new Rose attack. And, okay, I thought it was gonna tell me the name, but it does not. Also, let's see how much money I have now. <laughs> wow, I net gained quite a bit there. Let's go. That's, that's the real ultimate money-making technique. But now that we have the Ultra Hammers, we can head over to the place I was thinking of that has the Bean Bean Surfing Spot. I just have to get through this area. I'll probably get one encounter with a Sharpie, knowing my luck. No, wow. Okay, now if I remember, the place I'm looking for is just on this screen over here. Um, yes, it is. We can now get to the Bean Bean Beach surfing spot. Let's go. Hey there. Huh? You wanna cross the sea? Why, such a thing is impossible. Without a surfboard, that is. Say, maybe if you can find something to jam into that hole. Maybe it'll make some sort of surfboard substitute. Maybe. Well, <laughs> I'm sorry, Luigi, but that text was green. Oh, no. That's not... That, that's not how this works. Well, we can surf now. Joke's end looks like it was up that way. But I want to explore. I want to surf. Oh, there were, there's coin balloons. Give me those coins. Yeah, I'm just kind of going. Why not? Ooh, I'm just following these balloons. Where are you going to take me? Oh, how am I not hitting these balloons? Oh. Okay, these balloons were in, like, a plus symbol, so I don't know which way to go to follow them. So I will just go down here. Um, okay, what's over here? Another balloon. Another balloon there. More balloons. <laughs> okay. Here's another one. These have to be taking me somewhere, right? Uh, well, here is somewhere. Um... <laughs> oh! <laughs> yeah, Mario just brought an air pump. Okay, that works, I guess. Okay, dude. I've 
got a little game going on here. Any chance you two might be interested in playing? Uh, sure. Wanna hear the rules? Uh, no, I didn't want to hit no. Okay. Well, Mar Mario's just T-posing there. So, based on this, I assume it's a race. I'm gonna hit these balloons because... Oh, the, that number is going down when I hit the balloon, so I think I have to hit all of these balloons in a short amount of time. Okay. Let's go. Go down there. Uh, oh, there's that balloon. Okay. Oh, that's a barrel. That's probably not great. That kind of slowed me down a bit. No, turn around! Oh, you can't actually just turn around. You have to, like, actually turn around. You can't just hit the other direction. Unless you're in the air, I guess. Okay, I've hit all of them. I guess I have to return back to the place. Yep. Finished! Oh, wait, that's a different guy. The guy up there is purple. Hmm. Hello there. Let's see how you did. Your elapsed time is 49 seconds. Not bad, not bad at all. But you've still got work to do. See if you can do it in 45 seconds. Here, here is my present. We got a Hoobeen, okay. Yeah, let's try and get below 45 seconds. Okay. Going over, I think you want to try and jump less, because it really seems like you get slowed down when you jump. Really, how did I miss that? I'm just gonna restart after that one. Yep. Okay. This time, for sure. Okay, grab that, grab that, grab that, and grab that one. First screen cleared. Okay, just... Okay, I did get both of those in one jump. Didn't think I was going to. Turn down. Make sure you don't have to readjust to get other balloons later. Okay, I didn't hit that barrel. That's probably good. Oh, that was slow. I just <laughs> completely stopped. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't know if I can get 45 seconds like this. That bomb barrel is slow. Come on! I was so close. Well, maybe next time. Span through the text. Oh, wait. It counted it? Okay, well, I got a chuckle bean and it said to try and do it in under 40 seconds, so let's go. Oh, thank God. Oh, I've been recording for 46 minutes, and I got that. Let's go. Let's see how you did. Your elapsed time is 39 seconds. Wowzers, you are something else. But can you break... No. 
No, I, I, I refuse. That, that took me way too long. But also, I, I can't just leave it when there's a time I need to be. What do I do? I'll try it a few times. I have to go all the way back up? Well then, I'm gonna go up. And I'll give it a few tries. I'm not doing a whole lot. I don't want to be here for hours. No! One second off. Really? Okay. Now that I got that close, I have to. I have to do it. Ooh, that's bad. Well, it's fine, because I'm not good. Yes! Let's go! I've been recording for 57 minutes. Okay. Let's see. What do I get for this? Wow! Wow, 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 wow! Enough already. Here. Here is my present. We got casual coral. Wanna try again? No. This is not fun. I had no fun doing that. I mean, I, I kind of did. It was it was fine. I just had to go too fast. Oh. That's a lot of defense. 60% poison dodge. Um, sure. Mario's overdue for an upgrade anyways. Okay, well. Um, I guess that's your reward. Um, it's up to you to decide if it's worth it or not. Um, on my experience, the answer is no. That- that took way too long. <laughs> but, this is another classic case of I have absolutely no clue how long the episode is. So, I'm gonna head towards, um, Jokes End Now, which I think on the map, it was more like top right. So, I'm gonna be heading over there. And then, I- <laughs> I'm, I'm, I think I'm just gonna end the episode to be safe, because I have no clue how long this has been running. Um, I'm gonna check the map. Okay, I'm basically there. Just have to sort of go in this direction, but these spikes are blocking my path. Did I go too high? Maybe? Maybe not? Maybe this is where I'm supposed to be? Oh, okay, Th this seems like the place. There's a bunch of black rocks I need to break. I'll break them all just because. And we have made it- ooh, fast travel point. Yep, this is Joke's End with warp point 9. Um, I should technically have warp point 7, so really we're only missing 3 and 6. That's cool. Um, so let's just stay here at Joke's End. And is there, like, a save point or anything anywhere? Is there a save point or anything anywhere? God, those stairs are so slow to climb up. Oh, hello there. Hold it, you two. This place is our playground, understand? Do you two want to play here, too? In that case, the least you could do is say hello to those of us who are here first. Mario says hello, and Luigi's just so confused. Eh? Me? I'm Jojora. I'm a buddy of the cousin of the descendant of the spirit uh, who once guarded this place. 
Cacoletta, but actually it's Bowletta. Peach. Bowletta and Peach. Princess Peach. Bowletta. Man, I have no idea what you're talking about. Whatever. Look, if you want to go inside, then go right ahead. Be my guest. Go nuts. I don't know what kind of adventure you've been on to get here, but man. Getting through here won't be nearly as easy as what you're used to. No way. Well then, it seems like we have <laughs> a difficult journey ahead of us. Um, there is a hole here that looks like it needs some fire. Probably not great to do in what looks like an ice palace or snow palace, I don't know which one. Um, I don't know what that thing is, but it's probably an enemy. And finally, a save book. <laughs> so, um, this could be a terribly short episode. If it is, I'm sorry. Um, but I've been recording for an hour at this point, and I'd rather it not be like 50 minutes accidental instead of like 20 accidentally. Er, yeah, I think I said that right. I'd rather it be too short than too long, basically. So, <laughs> with us making it here to joke's end, I think I'm gonna end this episode off here. So, next time on Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga, we're going to start adventuring through joke's end, uh, and probably not make it to the end. <laughs> so, see you guys then.